Hey guys, Dan and Antoine here. Welcome back to episode 80. Woohoo, all the way up to 80 now. And this episode, I want to. First of all, uh, I would need to move the coke oven down here because it just looks out of the way up here, to be honest. So I'm just going to move it down. Um, I did just lose a bunch of creosote oil, but yeah, I'm not too fussed. We're going to have a lot more of that in the. Uh, in the future and I'm not too sure if I'm actually going to need too much of it because because um, I'm not really going to use Railcraft too much so I don't think I'll need like massive amounts of it but for now we shall see so let's just quickly rebuild this. I think that's how it goes. I think that's how I had it upstairs. Yeah, it was. Sorted. Um, just put a stack of coal in there for now so it'll do its thing. Um, this I'm not going to have too automated. Um, pretty much just going to have it how it was before with a little exception of uh, where's my hammer with a little exception of I'm going to have tanks probably here um, now I know the iron tank is probably the best um, the best way to go but I really like this. Um, okay, real quick, I'm just going to. I need some patterns. So let's try. Can we make 20 of them? We should be able to. Uh, six will do for now. I'm, if I need the others, I'll put them back in. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to encode glass patterns and then. I'm going to encode that as well. Just so I can make, like, I don't know, 22? That seems like a good number. So now I've got 24 of these. Ooh, that's a problem. I need to light this up. I forgot about that. Luckily, I've got quite a lot of torches. Um, and what button was it? F7. I got some cool stuff. I got some gunpowder. Always nice to have a bit of gunpowder. Not that I'm really going to use it for anything, but. Oh well. Yeah, I just want to light this up a little bit so that mobs can't spawn down here and eventually I'll probably have like a far better way to light it up but for now that'll do so what I'm going to do is literally just make a big square of this stuff and I'm hoping it will actually go into there I'm not sure I've never tried it before. Ooh. Um I need three more. I thought that was enough. Because I had twenty four of them, didn't I? I don't know. So you know what? I'm gonna cut the middle out. Just because I can. So I'm going to need, um, do I have any item ducks on me? I do. I'll take one of them. And I need a pneumatic server, which I think I've got some of. I do. So yeah, I'm not sure. Ah, no, it's not item ducks. It's fluid ducks, isn't it? Because it's going to be a fluid coming out. Uh, so I want that. And we'll just have to wait and see if it... Oh, 
yeah, there we go. It's actually putting it in. That's perfect. Not sure how I'd get it out of there, but oh well. Uh, worst comes to worst, what I can do is put it into a fluid transposer and then just pipe into buckets if I need it. So that's not too terrible. Also, I've noticed that if I keep, like, I've got no energy on this, but if I keep this cell in my hand, I think it uses the power out of this. Like, if I chuck it down, I can, my, you can tell that I haven't got night vision, but if I pick it up, I have. Which I thought was pretty cool. But I'm just going to put that back up there, because I don't really need it now. Right. The thing that I want to start working on this episode, um, just have that up there. I'm just going to sort my inventory out real quick because I don't need a, like any of this stuff really. Um, don't need that. That can all stay. That should be good. Right. What I want to work on is. Um, if I can find it, du -du -du -du, there it is, Thorncraft. Now, I've, I've never really delved too deep into this mod, so I'm not too sure how I'm going to go with it, so I might need some help. But, if I go over here, the first thing I need, more than anything, is the iron capped wooden one, so I need iron caps. And for that, I need. Right. First, I'm going to need a stick. And then I need some iron. No, not Rion. Iron. So I think I'll need two of those. And there we go. And then just put that there, that there, and that there. Now, what I need is. Duh, 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 a bookshelf, which I should be able to make. I can. So, the very first step of Thorncraft is making a bookshelf in a wand, and then. Boom! Right click in the uh, bookshelf, and now. Ho ho! I've got my Thorminomicon. Thorminomicon, is it? Yeah. So, that's the very very start now there's quite a lot to this so yeah first thing that I'm going to need is probably um, scribing tools uh, I'm hoping I can make them um, do I have any glass bottles? There we go. So, I've got the scribing tools. What about paper? Oh, I've got plenty of sugar cane, so that's fine. So, I'll keep that in my inventory. Uh, the next thing that I need to make is... Do -do -do the table. So what do I need? Blocks of wood and half slabs. Doesn't seem too difficult and I only need a couple of these. I think I need three. Should do. And what I'm going to do real quick off camera is make a little area for... Oh no, no. No, I don't need to. What I'm going to do is go up here and this little area is going to be my Thorncraft room. Um, I could probably do with clean up a little bit actually. So, let's get rid of this. It's taking forever to break. Um, do I need a wrench? I'll go away, you there. Right, so let's go get a lunch, a lunch, a lunch, a lunch. Uh, I'm going to need to pick up some stone bricks as well. Uh, have I got any stone bricks? 
Oh, I do. I've got plenty of them. Um, and actually, you know what? I'm going to do it the easy way, and I'm just going to, boom, put a portal down. I think I've still got my wrench, and I'm pretty sure this is for this. I'm hoping so, anyway. But luckily, if I forget anything, I've now got my portal down. There we go. So that's better. Um, I'm going to want to move this bookshelf. Really need to get an axe. To be honest with you. You know what? It stops there. Now, what about all this stuff? Quick question. If I do this, can I take it through the portal? I can. Nice. Uh, <laughs> that is so cool. For now, I'm just going to put them down over here. I'll sort them out in a little while, but for now, I just need to get them out of here. I'll just do this real quick. And the last one. Now I'm not sure if you can move chests with this. I've never really tried. Let's try, shall we? Oh, you can. That's pretty cool. So I'll just put those together. Oh, there we go. Um, everything else sh should be alright to stay. So, let's get started on our Thorncraft. What was that? Oh, that's my writing desk. So I'm going to want that there, and I'm going to put that there. And then I simply right click that with that, and then I need the scribing tools for this one. So that's now an arcane table, arcane work table, bench, whatever. And then, boom. And that is our new table. Oh, this is the new Thorncraft thing. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Um, right. I need. D -d 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 let's have a quick look. I need the thumb thermometer, thermometer, whatever. So I need two shards of any type, glass and gold. Um, yeah, I can manage that. Luckily, I've got a decent amount of gold. Right. So we've got our first thumb. Th Thermometer. I'm just going to call it a thermometer. So basically, what I'm going to do now is just go around and scan absolutely everything that I can. So it's probably going to take me a while to be able to do all of this. Uh, da -da -da. Yeah, there are quite a few things that I can't actually scan just yet. But it shouldn't be too too worrisome. Can't scan that. What about sandstone? Can I scan that? Yeah. And soul sand, what about that? No, I don't. I'm not good enough to scan that yet. Uh, duh, duh, duh. What else? Gravel? Can I scan gravel? Yep. What about grass? No, I'm not smart enough for grass just yet. Uh, let's go outside, shall we? Oh, cobblestone. I haven't scanned that. Coal. Yeah. Getting quite a lot of research. Stone bricks. Pressure plates. No, I can't scan wood just yet. Um, let's go see if I can scan the wood over here. 
No, I don't think I'll be able to. No. Not to worry. Oh, I can't scan Clay. Um. Oh. I might be able to if I go under here. Yes, yes, I know I'm dying. Yes, sweet. Why is it taking so long for me to break these blocks with this? It's not broke. What? It is broken. I think I'll just find a bug. Uh, so I need to actually go and fix this, and that is very, very bloody loud. Right, I need to go and fix this pickaxe properly. It seems that if you just put moss on it when it's broken, it doesn't actually repair it. Um, I think I found a bug. Woohoo! Right. So let's go quickly repair this. And hopefully after that I shouldn't have to repair it again. Uh, duh, duh, duh. There we go. Reinforce, look, haste and auto repair. There we go, it's updated now. So that's why I couldn't break that other block as well. Um, right. So what I'm probably going to... How are these getting on? 0% growth. Wow. Can I? No. I didn't know this showed you the growth of things as well. That's pretty damn cool. Um, yeah, so I'm dying of hunger, whatever. Can I scan the pig? No. Pigs are too complex for me. Sugar cane? No. So what I think I might have to do is just go off camera and do it. Uh, I need this one. Um, you know what? I'm just going to grab a stack of apples. Boom. Ooh. Luckily I won't die now. Uh, I need to charge this up. Where's my energetic infuser? Actually, where is it? Oh, crap. Wow. <laughs> God. Okay, so... That didn't go too well. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, fuck. Ah. Uh. Yeah, uh, where is my inner... I can't remember where I put it. Oh, that's right, it's over here. I can't believe I just died to that. I don't even know how he spawned. Um, let's have a look. There are still a few places it can spawn. Oh, that is actually mad, my dad. That was just so cool. It was like, hello, I'm going to blow up in your face. Yeah, thanks, Creeper. Appreciate it. Oh, God. I'm just going to chuck one up there. Right. These bloody Creepers, eh? Tut, tut, tut. Oh, that did mount my dad, though. So, I'm happy. So which one's the auto feeder? It's not that one, is it that one? Yes. So my helmet is basically the one that does everything, <laughs> really. Which is good to know. Okie doke, this should be... Oh, it's going to take a little while because it's obviously draining quite a bit of power. That's nice and full now, but I don't need it for... Um, actually, I'll take it and I'll put it in my bag. 
it's quite good because then now I know that I can use it for my armor I can technically use it as a backup battery which should be quite helpful um, actually something I want to look at real quick is is it this one kinetic generator uh, two servos and a control circuit let's see what it takes to make that, that's not too difficult, I might be able to make it and what about that oh I actually might be able to make this uh, do I have the materials for that, I don't so I need this, so I need some more cables now do I actually have the required material for cables, I don't think I do oh wrong one um, do, 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 do I have these? I do. Let's just make a few. They always come in handy. So let's make some more of these. Let's just make all of them, because why not? So I'm going to need four of these if I am correct in my maths. And I need some more of these bloody things. Right, so I've got all those that I need. Um, now I need these, which are probably quite costly. Um, six, I think, might do it. No, it won't. Oh, God. No, I want that one. Let's see if that'll be any better. I also need to make some more of these. Let's see how that does for now. Um, so I've got two of those. So I should be able to make one of those. Um, so I need my hammer again and I need some iron. So let's just grab a. Um, as many um, it's like that isn't it for this yeah sweet so I'm just gonna grab a stack of that so servo um, I d all I need is another one of them so do 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 Oh yeah, I need to actually make these first. Um, three should do. Um, make two of those, and then I should be able to make the second one of them. That's great. And then I need the control. Do, 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 do. Where is it? There it is. Uh, do I have enough of that? I need one more of those. So hopefully I've got enough materials, which I do. Sweet. And then. Um, go into this. I can install it on that as well. Oh no, that's a dimensional tear generator. Don't think I'll be needing that just yet. So, uh, heat generation. Um, you know what? I'm going to actually put it up to the max because it's going to be worth it. Yeah, seems good to me. So I've got all my uh, all my energy for my gear sorted now, which should hopefully help out quite a lot. So what I think I might do, actually, how long have I been going? I've been going about half an hour. Um, du -du -du. Okay, what I'm going to do? I'm going to end this episode. Um, between episodes, I'll try and scan quite a few things get some out of the way uh, possibly even try and find some nodes because they always give quite good stuff to scan um, yeah so I'll do that um, next episode I shall come back and hopefully have some decent amount of researchy points things 
and we can start having a look at uh, having a look into Thorncraft, which should be quite cool. So thank you for watching. Yes, that's what I'm going to say. Um, if you like the video, leave a like down below, clicking the thumbs up button thingy. Uh, if you didn't like it for any reason, dislike it and leave a comment down below to tell me why, because I really need to know. You know, I want to know what you guys think. Um, and if you want to say anything to me in general, just leave a comment down below. And if you would like to subscribe to me and uh, like watch my videos when they come out that would be awesome because I would love you and that would make me happy and it means that I would get even more incentive to do this what the hell give me even more incentive to do this like to keep going uh, but that's it for this episode so thank you for watching and I shall see you next time <laughs>